Hey guys, it's Crazy Coupons. Welcome back to my channel. And in today's video, we're going to go on a little adventure. I'm going to take you all with me to a new store called Pop Shelf. So before we get started, if you haven't already subscribed, please consider doing so. Don't forget to hit that thumbs up button because it's a free way that you can help your girl out. And as always, if you have any questions, comments, deals you want to share, or if you just want to say hello, y'all know I love hearing from you. So go ahead and leave me a comment down below before you go. And also take a minute and share this video with somebody that you know so that they can get in on these deals as well. All right, guys, let's jump right in. All right, guys, so since some of you may not have heard of this new Pop Shelf store yet, I'm just going to give you a quick little background on it. So these new Pop Shelf stores are actually owned by Dollar General. How cool is that? So Dollar General now has their regular stores, their home stores, their DG markets, and now Pop Shelf. So before we went on our trip to Hendersonville, Tennessee, which is where this Pop Shelf store that I'm going to show you in this video is located, I did a little research and I looked up a couple of articles about these new Pop Shelf stores. So I'm going to leave those linked down in the description box below if you want to read further. But I'm just going to point out a couple of things from those articles that I found. One of the articles that I found said that the new Pop Shelf stores will be larger than the average Dollar General with the goal of offering customers a less cluttered appearance, which is a big thumbs up for me, and an enjoyable shopping experience. And I had a blast. So again, a big thumbs up for Pop Shelf. Also, here's a fun fact. Prices at Pop Shelf stores are rounded to the nearest dollar with a 95% of the retailer's items priced at just $5 or less. Now, one of the articles that I have linked in the description box below says that the company has so far opened 16 Pop Shelf locations and has plans in the works for an additional 50 by the end of 2021. Now, Dollar General is also introducing the new combination stores where it's a DG market and a pop shelf. So it's like a small pop shelf store stuck into the DG market. So you may already have one near you. And according to this article, they plan on having 25 more of these combination stores by the end of 2021. All right, guys, so let's go ahead and walk on in to Pop Shelf. So this was the first thing that I saw. This huge display of Halloween decorations and everything that you see was sold at Pop Shelf. So it was very cool. As soon as you walk in, nice high ceilings, open spaces, nice clean store. Everything was where it was supposed to be in its place. Um, the employees were super nice, greeted you right at the door, asked you if you needed anything, if you needed help finding anything. Um, so very, very cool. Just, just walking in the store was awesome. Now, when we went on our trip to Hendersonville, this was before Halloween, so they still had all of their Halloween items out, and um, I thought they were very cool decorations. A lot of this stuff I hadn't seen anywhere else, and they were pretty high quality items and reasonably priced. So they had all kinds of cute Halloween decor items. They had signs, pumpkins, floral arrangements. They even had games and cute little different kinds of candies that I hadn't seen anywhere else. I would almost describe this as kind of like a five below meets Big Lots meets Dollar General, Dollar Tree kind of vibes, if that makes sense. And they definitely had a lot of high quality, really beautiful items, especially their fall decor. If I wasn't so focused on filming this video for you guys, I probably would have bought a lot more than I did because there are so many cute things to choose from. So just so you all don't have to listen to me talk this entire video, I'm going to turn on a little music for you so that you guys can check out all of these awesome fall home decor items.
All right, guys, so I'm back. What did you all think about all of those awesome home decor items? Now we're moving on into the beauty section of the store. And let me tell you, they had a humongous selection to choose from. Everything from makeup brushes to little trimmers to any kind of makeup that you could possibly need or want. They had all kinds of items. You're going to see some brands that we know that we see all the time at DG and other stores that we coupon at. But you're also going to see some brands that are specific to Pop Shelf. So in this section that I'm showing you here, they had this huge wall of this brand. And I'm pretty sure it's only found at Pop Shelf. It is called Be Different. If you guys have seen this brand anywhere else, please let me know down in the comment section. They had all kinds of brushes, eyeshadows, nail tools, you name it. And everything was just one or two dollars. All right, so here are just some more personal care items. And I know that some of you all will recognize this brand here. It is called Good Baths. So they do carry this at Dollar General Home Stores. At least the one near me has some of these items, but nowhere near as big of a selection as they had at Pop Shelf. At my home store, they literally just had this small end cap. It's just kind of some random items thrown on there. Uh, but at Pop Shelf, they had everything nice and organized. They had a big variety of scents to choose from and just more products to choose from in general. So as you can see here, the Good Baths products ranged anywhere from $1 all the way up to $5. They had a huge selection. They had these cute little lip glosses that you can just throw in your purse. The little hand lotions as well. Those were just $1. They had the um, little scented oil warmer starter kits. Very cool. Then they had a huge, and I'm telling you, a huge selection of bath products. Now, one thing that I thought about while I was walking through the store was that they had all kinds of really cute items that you could easily throw together and make a really cute gift basket for someone's birthday or Christmas or whatever it may be. They had all of these really cute little nail sets, face masks galore. All of these face masks that you see there are just $1. Right below there, they have some face tools, some trimmers, and again, some of these brands you are going to recognize. We've got some Believe Beauty thrown in there, some Vivitar. I know y'all have seen that at DG before. And here are some more really cute little sets, little bath towels, hair wraps, mirrors. I mean, they had it all. All right, guys, so in this little video clip here, I am showing you this huge wall that they had inside of Pop Shelf that was cram-packed full of nothing but face products. So they had everything from moisturizers to masks to face wipes, you name it, they had it available. Now again, y'all are going to see some name brand items that we all know, love, and trust. There we have Dove, Pons, Noxema, but whenever I tell you they had this wall completely packed, well stocked, well organized. They had so much to choose from. It was amazing. And I'm definitely going to pick up a few items whenever I go back and try them out.
All right, guys, so now we're moving on into the household section of the store. So we're going to see a lot of different cleaners, soaps, you know, just all of our normal household products that we need to pick up. Now, one thing that I did notice um, at this pop shelf store is that they do carry some of the more like all natural higher end cleaners that you may only find at like Target or Walmart. So I thought that was pretty cool. Just something different that you can't get at the other Dollar General stores, but just look at how nice and organized these shelves are. So another thing that I noticed that was different at Pop Shelf versus our normal Dollar General stores was that Pop Shelf is self-checkout only. Now, there were three or four employees there working while I was shopping at Pop Shelf, so that always meant that there was somebody at the self-checkout just in case you needed help, but that also meant that the other employees could walk around the store, organize the shelves, restock, and help customers, and you could really tell a difference in how the store's appearance was. I mean, everything was just so well organized. Um, it was just really an enjoyable experience. All right, guys, I'm back again. And as you can see from the last few video clips, Pop Shelf has a lot to offer. So they had household supplies, pet supplies. They even had a little electronic section as well as paper products and food items. They also had a little section for diapers and baby supplies as well. And now we are kind of in this little seasonal section of back to school supplies. And of course, you can't leave out the toy section, so I'm going to say it again. I think they had a really good variety to choose from. They had toys priced from $1 all the way up to $5, and they had name brand stuff. So just a second ago on the screen was some Thai Beanie Babies. Here you see Mickey and Minnie and the Disney Princesses. And then, of course, Star Wars. You can't go wrong with Star Wars. So this little section kind of reminded me of like the Five Below stores. All right, guys, so now we're moving into our party supply section. This was on the back wall of the store, and let me tell you, I was very, very impressed. They had all kinds of colors, different themes that you could choose from, different ways that you could mix and match, and I was just very surprised at just the sheer variety and selection that they had in this store. 
All right, guys, so now we're moving into the craft section at Pop Shelf, and this was by far my favorite section of the store. Now, I literally could have spent hours just in this section of the store alone because they had so much to choose from. Every craft that you could possibly imagine, they had it, and they had everything that you could possibly need. Now, I know that y'all don't know this about me. The only thing y'all know is I love to coupon, and I love to save money, and that's awesome, but I also love to craft with whether we're painting, drawing, crocheting, journaling, uh, just sitting down and doing some hand lettering. I love all of that stuff. So this part of the store was right up my alley. And when I tell you any kind of craft that you could possibly think of and all of the supplies that you could ever need was right there at Pop Shelf. It was amazing. And I was very, very impressed with this part of the store. All right, guys, so we're getting close to the end of this little Shop With Me at Pop Shelf video. And here are just some little miscellaneous items. They had some jewelry, some wallets, some fun, funky socks, keychains, little coin purses. And here is just a wall of pens and markers in every color that you could possibly imagine. So at the end here, you're going to see another little home decor section. And I really like that they had the seasonal home decor and then the regular just everyday home decor items separate in separate parts of the store. That was very, very neat. And some of these items you may have found at your home stores. I know that there was a few patterns on like these coffee cups that I had noticed um, at my home store. But they just again, they just had a huge selection to choose from.
All right, guys, so we made our way all the way around the store, and now we were back up front, and they had this little section of Christmas items already being put out on the shelves, and I cannot wait to go back. I am definitely going back for a second trip to Hendersonville. We're going to check out Pop Shelves, see what kind of new seasonal items they have in stock, as well as I'm going to be going to a DG Market. Now, when we go, I'm definitely going to try to find one of the DG Market Pop Shelf Combination stores, and I will be bringing you guys along for the ride. So I'm very excited about that. But I know that all of y'all are wondering, what did you pick up at Pop Shelf? Well, the really cool thing about Pop Shelf is that they have a Pop Shelf Rewards program. So if you go onto their website before you visit the store, sign up for the rewards program. You're going to get an email with a little barcode in there. And once you check out, you can show one of the employees your little barcode. They'll scan it and then they're going to give you a little mystery box full of goodies. So y'all are going to have to come back for Pop Shelf Part 2 and I'm going to show you all what I ended up buying while I was at Pop Shelf. Plus, we are going to do our first unboxing on this channel and we are going to open up that Pop Shelf Rewards box and find out what kind of goodies are inside. Now that Pop Shelf box has been sitting on my kitchen table for about two weeks now and I cannot wait to open it up and see what's inside and share it with you all. So please come back and check out Part 2. And here's just a couple of pictures that I snapped while we were on our road trip. The weather was perfect and I also took my little chihuahua along for the ride. So we had an amazing time and I cannot wait to go back. All right guys, so that's it for me for now. But like I said, come back for part two where I show you what I ended up purchasing at Pop Shelf. And also we're going to open up that mystery box. Now y'all let me know down in the comment section, do you have a Pop Shelf store near you? Or maybe you have one of those combination DG Market Pop Shelf stores. Let me know down in the comment section. And also let me know, would you like to see more of these Shop With Me videos? All right, guys, like I said, that's it for me for now. But if you're not already subscribed, please consider doing so. Don't forget to hit that thumbs up button because it's a free way that you can help support my channel. And as always, if you have any questions, comments, deals you want to share, or if you just want to say hello, y'all know I love hearing from you. So please leave me a comment down below before you go. And also take a minute and share this video with somebody that you know so that they can get in on these deals as well. All right, guys, thank you all so, so much for watching. I hope you have a great day and I will see you on the next one.